Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, once more, we have this question, question three of 2024 GCE Mathematics Paper Two, and this is section A, question three. Yeah. yeah. So th this is question three A and question three B. So I'm going to answer question three B first under vectors, then we'll answer question um 3a later because the purpose of this video is just to answer question what's this question is this question vectors now when you look at the instructions here in the following diagram o a o vector a is this one o b is this that you asked to say a x to a b is two to three. O X A X where is A X A X is here A X here up to here is two but from A to B is three. Does this one is a little bit different from uh, the common questions that they usually ask in exams. Why? Because this is not the ratio as from here up to here and here to here. Okay? It is from A to X and from A to B. So you need to take note of that because uh, you can make a serious mistake here. Okay. So I'll explain that later. Let's jump right into it and solve it. Now, the first question here, the first question we are asked to find uh, A, B. A, B. So I'm going to say this is question 3, uh, B. So we're going to say so a b vector a b. So a b is equals to look at where a is is a is here. So this is the origin. So we're going to move a o plus o b. Why? Because you have vectors here. Why are you going this side? Meanwhile, we don't have any of, we don't have even both vectors. So I'm going to use A O plus O B. So I'm going to say vector A O plus O B. Then let's just substitute. What is A O? A O is vector A. Now, since it's positive, opposite of this vector, it's going to be negative. Negative vector A. It's, opposite, it's moving in the opposite direction. Plus, are we moving in the opposite direction of the vector? No. Okay, we are moving in the direction of the vector. So, I'm going to write, is that it's going to be the way it is as positive. B. But remember, vectors should be written um, starting with a positive uh, positive vector so we're going to start with this one we're going to say vector b minus a we just arrange okay the signs the signs uh, don't change because we're just changing positions but not, not crossing the equal sign i hope you understand uh, that so this is question b 1 a so b 1 a i mean b there we are asked to find the vector xb. Okay, so xb. So let's do this. xb here. We are asked to find the vector x xb. How can we find this xb? Listen and listen very, very carefully. Listen. A x is 2 okay a x is 2 but a b is what is 3 so in other words here from here to here so let me just say from here up to here let's say a and x is here is 2 but from here from a to b is 3 Okay, then what is this distance? X, let's say XB. What is XB? For 2 to become 3. 
what is this missing? It is 1. Okay? The missing distance here is 1. So, we're going to say, so total vector here, we're not, we, we don't add these ratios. Why in this video we're not adding? Because the total, a uh, total is 3. So you have to be very careful, don't add and write uh, maybe 3 over 5, 2 over 5, no. This question was different. So XB is going to be, what is the value here on the X is 1. Over what is the total distance from A, uh, what is the length from A to B here? The value of A, B is what? 3. Okay. 3, 1 over 3, vector A what? A, B. Vector A, B. Okay. So, we're going to say 1 over 3. What is A, B? A, B is this one, which is, we've already calculated here, as vector B minus A. This is the answer. By the way, if there is a question that we are going to use XB, we are going to use the expanded one here. We are going to expand this one. So take note of that. The next question is um, find XO. Vector XO, so this is C. XC, XO. Where is X? XO. So we are going to say XO plus O. Um, I mean, x o here, x is the origin. We're going to move x b plus b o because x b we've already calculated is this one, okay? But x a we don't know would have moved here if we knew uh, this one. So x o is going to be x b okay this this vector here plus b o this one all right plus b o mm -hmm. so now what is x b this is the x b one over three but let me just substitute the expanded one one times b is going to be vector b over three okay like this minus 1 times a is going to be vector a over 3 plus what is b o? b o is opposite of this vector, so it's going to be negative b. Alright, negative b. So let me just write here negative b plus negative b. Then, do you have like terms? Yes, we do. So we're going to say vector b over 3 this is negative b so it's going to be negative b the way it is vector b minus um vector a here over 3 okay you can make this one as a fraction by writing over over 1 common denominator here is 3 3 into 3 1 1 times b is just the b vector b there's a minus here 3 into 3 is just 3, then 3, uh, 1 into 3, I mean, 1 into 3 is 3, 3 times b, it is 3b, alright, minus a over 3. Now, there's an invisible one here, so 1 minus 3 is negative 2b, over 3 minus vector a over 3 okay let's just leave it here in fact this is the answer okay because both numbers are negative so you can say it starts with the positive starts with positive both vectors are negative in this case so this is the x o vector x o is it o x x o okay X O. Now the last one is going to test us. It's going to show us whether we've been doing the correct thing, because we're asked to show. 
So they're saying given that O y is equals to three times O x, show that show that B y is equals to A plus B. See, simple as this, but it's two marks. So if we are, we will be able to show this one, it means that everything here that we've been doing um, is correct. Mm. So this is the question. Given that this one is equals to this one, show that this one is equals to this. All right. So this is the, this this will be the first one. So we I'm going to we're going to say O y uh, uh, O y is equals to three times O x. What is O x? O x we've already calculated here. Did O x O x O? Um, oh yeah, it is O x. So it is opposite. It is opposite of this. So showing that it is opposite of this. Uh, okay. Showing that it is opposite of this, we are going to multiply this one by negative. So, uh, OX is going to be negative, open bracket, negative 2B over 3 minus A over 3. So, everything is going, is going to multiply by negative. Negative is negative, positive. Let me just even write here. 2 vector b over 3 negative times this post negative it will be positive vector a over um, 3 simple as this let's proceed okay now since we have fractions here everything has uh, every term here has a fraction we can simply say o y vector o y is equals to this 3 and this 3 will cancel. This 2 and this 3 will cancel. Remain with 2 vector b. This 3 and this 3 will also cancel. We will remain with just the vector a. Okay? So this is the first part. This is not the final answer, but this is just the first, the first part. So, what I'm going to do... Oh, by the way, you can, you can multiply first here, then divide. 3 times 2, 6. And 6 divided by 3 is still 2. 3 times negative, but there's an invisible one. 3 times 1, 1, 3 into, oh, 3 times 1, 3, 3 into 3, 1. Now, they're saying show that B, Y, show that B, vector B, Y is equals to A plus B. Okay, so this is what we need to show. So, to show that one, you need to use by. They have just given you uh, something to work on. So by to work with, I mean. So by is equals to. Let's check here on the uh, on the question original question. So b is here. By. How are we going to move to for, to, for by? Automatically, we're going to supposed to use. So automatically, we're going to use B, Y, since it's B, Y, we're going to move, we're going to, going to use what we have. We do have B, X, yeah, we can find B, X, is there, we, we have X, B. Do you have X, Y, no. So we're going to move B, O, plus O, Y, because O, Y, we've already calculated it, and B, O, is already here. B, O, is negative B. So here, we're going to say... B O plus O Y. All right. Now, like I said here, look at B O. B O is negative B, since it's all moving in the opposite direction. So it's going to be negative B vector B like this. Plus O Y. What is O Y? O Y is this one. We've already calculated it. O Y. It is two vector B plus A. Okay, then we can say there's a negative one here. Negative this is the, the like terms, so negative one plus two is just one. Then since we have a b, we just write it, vector b plus a. Then we can just arrange this one starting with a, so that alphabetical order, so that it is equal to this one. So we can say vector a plus vector b. 
So this is by. So this is the answer. We can even, you can even write here hence shown. We've shown that a by is equals by is equals to a plus b vector as a and b there. So everything that is we, we we've been doing here is correct, starting from the word go. Okay, is what is correct. So now we can go now to question three a.